Hey parents, this is Scott with Revolution Modern Martial Arts, and since 2009, we have helped thousands of kids build their confidence and discipline so that they can be more successful at home, school, and in life. Many parents come to me because they're increasingly worried about their children's safety. You, like me, see so many stories on the news and social media, and parents just want to make sure they do everything they can to keep their children safe. When they see this stuff on the news, parents get really worried. They become afraid to let their kids out of their sight sometimes. Even sending a child to school or over to a friend's house can be daunting. Unfortunately, we cannot change the fact the world is not what it used to be. But we can change the level of safety your child experiences. And one key to keeping your child safe is teaching them how to have what we call situational awareness. Now, when I was a kid, I would ride my bike to my friend's house a couple miles away. I could spend the entire day there, even though this is well before the age of cell phones, my parents had very little to worry about. I, like you, know that many things have changed since we were kids. We need to teach our children to have situational awareness everywhere. Think about this. Most parents teach your kids to look both ways before crossing the street. That is just one example of situational awareness. It's basically a simple way of saying that we need to pay attention to the potential dangers around us and be aware of them. So parents, here is a little tip that you can use to help build your child's situational awareness. Play what I call the A game to help your children strengthen their observational skills. When you go into a business with your child, make note of a few things about your environment. For example, the number of workers behind the counter, the clothing and gender of the person sitting next to you, how many entries and exits there are, etc. When you leave the business and get in your car to head home, ask your kids questions like how many workers were behind the counter? Was the person sitting next to us a man or a woman? What color was his or her shirt? How many exits were there? You get the idea. Use your best judgment to craft your questions and be sure to congratulate your child when they answer correctly. This positive feedback will encourage your child to be more aware next time so they can do better in the game. And this game will help them have better situational awareness all the time. Listen, you know what? The fact you're watching this right now indicates that you're a dedicated parent who really cares about how your child turns out. I want to take a minute to thank you, not for watching the video, but for being an awesome parent. I think you and I can both agree, even though we may have never met, that we live in a pretty good country. And we could agree that the fabric of America is made up of the people who live here. Our kids are the next generation of people that will define what this country stands for. By being the parent you are, and by dedicating yourself to making sure that your child really makes the best decisions, you're ensuring that our country is going to be left in the hands of great individuals, and that is truly something important. So I want to offer you my respect, and I want to offer you my support. Until next time, this is Scott signing off. And by the way, if you know anyone who might benefit from hearing this message, please feel free to share this video. Thanks.